Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Heather. Today I'm so excited. I am finally redecorating our bedroom and I'm gonna try to do it on a budget. I'm gonna try to stay under $100 between Amazon, Target, and potentially Hobby Lobby if I have a little bit money left over. If I overshoot my budget with what I have here getting ready to redecorate with, then I won't get anything else, but I will take that opportunity to try to shop some things around my own home to decorate with. Um, but my main focus point is changing out our bed and changing out our curtains. If you don't know, we have had a Steamboat Willie room and the last remnant of Steamboat Willie room is like our comforter. We have Steamboat Willie and then y'all, we had black curtains. Like we went in this really, really hard. We had like this porthole. Um, mirror here. We just really went all out with him, but in the beginning we painted the, the room the wrong color blue. Um, I wanted more of a grayish blue and Lowe's failed and by the time I had it all painted and it dried, it brightened up to this crazy blue that you see. So it was not at all what we were looking for. And as you see, there's a Christmas wreath here above our bed that has been there since Christmas of 2019. So October, November when I started decorating, it's been up there since then. So <laughs> we um, we need to change that. I just, I never put our room completely back. All of the other Steamboat Willie stuff I've either got in our closet here or in the storage shed. And I just haven't put it back out. So it's kind of making me sad to take all of this apart, but I just really want a more feminine room. You know, black curtains are not that feminine. And I was trying to really do the Steamboat Willie thing. It was so much fun. And it's been like that since 2010, guys. 2010. So it's time for a change. Whether I want to keep Steamboat Willie or not, she's a change in. So I'm going to show you everything that I got here. I will leave links below. Shh. I'll leave links below of everything that I've purchased. Um... I don't have any like affiliate links. I'll just leave links below. Like I'm not going to be making anything from you guys. I just want to share everything that I was doing. That way if you like it and you were inspired to maybe purchase these things. And even if they're in a different color. Then that's fine. But I wanted to change it up. Get a little uh, more feminine look. And still not clash with this blue. Um, I want to paint it so bad. We were going to go get some gray paint. But I don't have the energy to move this bed. <laughs> so. We're just gonna leave it blue for a while and um, if we decide to go ahead and paint it I will update a video at a later date I guess or share pictures on Instagram I don't know I just it just seems like a lot of work y'all to move this bed to paint I mean we have a lot of stuff we've got a bookshelf we've got a giant dresser with a flat screen I mean there's a whole lot going on in here and you know just thinking about it it would be great it would be beautiful and it would put it it would make it complete for us, but I just, I don't think I have it in me right now to try to figure out how to move this bed. But if my sweet husband so desires to help me with that, then obviously we will update. Um, but yeah, let me go ahead and show you everything that I'm going to be doing today, and then we'll just go ahead and get started. So the first thing I'm going with here is this sheet set. I've got them in the dryer right now, so I'll be putting those on in just a minute. But this is a sheet set from Target and it's room essentials and they're microfiber. If you guys know me at all, I absolutely love flannel sheets year round. So I'm really scared. I'm really nervous. I don't know if you guys have used these before or not. I don't know how they will feel, but I'm thinking they might be cooler. I don't know. I really don't know, but we will see. They're in the dryer and it's like the white with the navy stripe. And then, y'all, this is the comforter. It's like a duvet. I mean, have you ever seen one package like this? I mean, there are massive jumbo packages in the stores everywhere. And here we have this rolled up thing. It looks like a neck roll pillow. So, um, yeah, this is three piece decorative. Oh, sorry. I was trying to read it. Three piece decorative pinch pleat white queen size. So we shall see. I did order one for Michaela in lavender for Christmas. And it did not come like this. It actually came in one of the square packages. So we'll see. It's kind of crazy. So we'll see. And then I got this really beautiful um, blanket to go across the bed. And it's real plushy and real nice. And here's what this packaging looks like. I'm like, they're trying to be minimalist. And I'm fine with that. And this is flannel, but it's not. 
I'll, um, I'll have to show you exactly what it is. And then I did buy new curtains. So these are white with those navy stripes. These are not blackout curtains like the, uh, the, the black ones that we have up are. But I'm thinking that's going to be okay. No big deal. And then the last item is this beautiful antique white like farmhouse rod that I found. And this is actually the same rod. I just reordered one that we used behind the TV. If you saw anything around Christmas from a Christmas home tour, this is the rod that we used behind the TV to hang a sheer white curtain with some fairy lights. And it's actually still up in there, but I thought that it would be really nice to go ahead and have this one. So eventually when we move, we will have two identical curtain rods if we need two for the bedroom or two for the living room. We've already got the exact same curtain rods and um, they're a pretty nice length. So I will show you exactly how long they are. Um, I'll take you in the other room right now. So there's my child coloring and of course the dog is sleeping. <laughs> You'll say hi, Michaela. Say hello. It's so dark in here because she is watching. Sorry for the laundry in that chair too, but she is watching Beauty and the Beast. So this is the rod. We tried to use an antenna. <laughs> we need to take that down. It's, it doesn't work. So anyway, this is how long the rod is. It's pretty long. Um, this is 55 inch TV, if that gives you any kind of um, a visual of what this is. So yeah, we really need to take that down. That's crazy eyesore. So let's get in here and get started. I have ordered some pillow covers from Amazon and Michaela is really needing entertain today, but I have ordered some pillow covers that are in the same dark navy color that I am using and everything else. They haven't came yet, so you'll probably see them in the end results of this video. So I'm really excited. That means Mickey's got to be put in the closet, so mm -mm -mm. it's been a fun ride, but it's time to change things up again. No more waiting until we get a house. It's time to live happy right now. Also, let's please excuse Damon's Funko mess over here. I don't know what we're going to do with all of that. I would love to find a cute little display for him, but we just don't have the space. So they'll probably still be stacked up there. We're just going to roll with it. So here is the pillow cover. It is so pretty. It's exactly what I wanted. It is a little wrinkly, but I mean, I can always take it off and steam it. I just want to go ahead and get it put together today. I love that it has a zipper. That is a huge, huge plus for me. Um, I hate where they have that flap and you've got to like smash the whole pillow in and tuck it in and it's just a whole thing. So I really love this so, so much. Um, yeah, I'm super excited. So I'm just going to go ahead and do the other one and open everything here so it is ready to go. And as soon as those sheets come out of the dryer, we'll make the bed. I will just give you guys a little warning that we have a mattress cover and not a mattress cover, but a mattress pad. It's like a memory foam. And uh, it's like these weird swirls of this bright ocean turquoisey color. And <laughs> so yeah, if you see that and it's like bright, that's what it is. So. Anyway, just wanted to put that little disclaimer out there and not that y'all care, but uh, if you're thinking what in the world does she get on her mattress, that's what, and it sleeps wonderfully. And it was $80 at Walmart. We've had it for over a year now and it's wonderful.
You guys, I cannot tell you how excited I am about how this looks. It looks so clean, so inviting, and it really just brightens up the room so much. I'm not even really mad about the blue paint. It's still not my best friend. I still don't like it, but I mean, I'm just so happy right now. Obviously, this still has to get replaced with something else. But, oh my gosh, you guys, can you even? It looks so inviting, so nice. Look at the texture on this blanket. Everything about this says relaxation and me time. Again, ignore all of that. But we have light, y'all. We have not had light in this bedroom, and I can't tell you how long, well, ever, because we always have the blackout curtains in here. But it's so nice to actually see some light shining through our bedroom. Look at this, guys. We have light in our bedroom. So maybe when I'm actually sitting here filming, um, we'll actually have some natural light coming in. I don't know we'll give it a go and see but I'm just in love with it and the reason I went with navy blue is because that's kind of what I wanted to go with once we get our own home is navy blue and white in our bedroom and find some really pretty things to put on the wall so the reason that I wanted to go with navy blue is because of this dresser I found this it was oak I actually got some Ralph Lauren paint and I painted it blue um, it had a track missing so it's kind of needs to be replaced but I painted it blue years ago and then I did the brushed nickel with the old hardware that was on there because this dresser is so old you cannot buy hardware to fit those um, specific measurements and go with the navy blue so it at least match our furniture and if I ever decide to change it out later on it's still not that big of a deal um, it's really really pretty the very next day the pillow covers came so I'll go ahead and show you exactly what they look like so they look so amazing there's a really nice texture to them nice little ruffles there so pretty and um, I love them I love how everything turned out everything looks so great I'm so excited and again I will leave everything linked below that I purchased to complete this look and I hope y'all enjoyed it I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.